know, one question we do often get from you know some of our customers is, how SEO friendly really is the Yahoo store for coming up in these search engines? You know, four years ago, I would have told you, well, you really need to hire somebody to help you, and then they're really SEO friendly. Um, the images they have um, when you put your mouse over them, there's a little text that shows in um, Internet Explorer, and that's what they call an alt tag in the search engines. Can you give us an example? Absolutely. Since we're talking relevancy, um, let's go into the book, Relevancy is Queen. <laughs> because we actually do know that. All right, and as we place our mouse over the image, we see that this book or this image is standing for the free ebook, and you can kind of catch that as you place your mouse over and you go back, but that is the alt tag. It's letting the search engines know, you know, what is this page? What is this image about on this page? because the search engines cannot read an image. <laughs> <laughs> so what does that mean? So the alt image for Yahoo stores would say click to enlarge. There's nothing relevant. The name of your product was an image. Your left navigation was an image. Now this was all in the past. Past. Long time ago. It wasn't very friendly. Now let's go into one of the newer sites. We use one choice for frogs. I'm just going to go in here into the store editor. And this is the new friendly Yahoo stores. I love these stores. Check this out. This has had no programming whatsoever. Our alt tag comes up right away with the name of it. Our left navigation is all in text. If we go to our item pages, we have fancy breadcrumbs. We didn't have breadcrumbs in the old stores. So. so the answer to the question is definitely yes. Yes, yes. definitely Yahoo stores are very SEO friendly. The other thing that I really love is it's all now CSS design. And for people who aren't familiar with that, CSS is cascading style sheets. In the past, you used to build web pages using what they call tables. And you would put tables within tables within tables within tables. <laughs> <laughs> what this created if you actually were to print this, uh, the coding out, mm -hmm. pages and pages of pages of code. Well, now what used to take up pages only takes up maybe half a page of code. Your code is a lot cleaner. Search engines can get to your content faster. faster. <laughs> and another way to look at it is, let's pretend you've got a house that's got spider webs all around it, but you're trying to sit on the couch that's in the middle. You know, you, you may not get to that couch in the middle because there's so much mess, there's so much clutter around it that you give up. Well, now the mess is gone, the cobwebs are gone, and all you see is the wonderful content. All you have to do is add content. And actually, if I can show you something real quick about how friendly the um, Yahoo stores are, I'm gonna go into our manager here and I'm gonna click on references. Now you have to understand, this store, there's no link to. This store is really just a play store that we use to train people, you know, and we thought frogs would be fun. Because <laughs> nobody could say that you're trying to be competition with us. <laughs> you know, but if you look, we are on Google. We're in Yahoo Shopping. We have references even from Yahoo. Nobody knows about this site. How is this possible? Well, it's just, it's a basic Yahoo store. The only thing that we've done with the store is added one product with good solid content of who, what, when, where, how, and why. So if you don't use a programmer, you could still get amazing results. And as a matter of fact, I'd love to show you, we actually, this is our references from Google. This is our reference that we got searched for, windbreaker jacket. Now, I can click on it and see that somebody found us here in Frugal. So I look and I don't see us. Oh, this is page two. Let's try page one. We're yeah. on page one. <laughs> and this is a sample site, not an actual site to buy product at, but it's just yeah. a sample site. And it's a Yahoo store. You know, the thing is, is that with the right content, 
the Yahoo store is definitely SEO friendly, as we've just seen. And very relevant, you know. Yeah. It keeps co comes back to what we're trying to show you here in this content is that content is king and as you've been saying Shauna relevancy is queen and as an example like this with the frog site something as simple as just putting up the right descriptions is putting up the right tags meta tags descriptions all that stuff is very important to your SEO and like you said it comes back down to content relevancy and taking it one step at a time don't try to do it overnight